Google is a dream company for many. Every year, lakhs and lakhs of students apply for Google and a very small fraction actually get an interview opportunity. And then a handful of people actually get an offer. Now, this process is so competitive that it can be said to be more strict than Harvard selection process. And not only Google, for every big tech giant like Amazon, Microsoft, Meta, the situation is same. But then how do you even get in there? That's what I'm going to tell in this this video. In this video, I will show you a four step method that you can apply to increase your chances of getting interviews at these companies. But before that, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, do subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you never miss on useful career related videos. Let's start with the first step, resume preparation. I call this step preparing your face and this is the most important part. You must be a very cool person. You must be a very skilled person. You can do so many things that no one in your friend circle can do. You must have brought so much impact in your previous projects. But if your resume is not well written, then no one cares because they won't come to check who you are. Your resume will tell who you are. So this is the first step. Do spend a good amount of time preparing your resume. And here are three things that you can do to improve your resume. Number one. Use a good resume template that is ATS friendly because that will help you a lot. Number two, break down your work experience section into context, task, result and tools use section and write accordingly. Number three, use proper action verbs like achieved, engineer, developed, etc. So we don't have time to discuss about resume improvements in detail in this video. But if you are someone who is struggling to build your resume and if you are very, very concerned that whether your resume is going to get selected in top product based companies or not, then you can take my hands on resume building workshop and build your resume with me. So in this workshop, we will be creating your resume from scratch, right from the template to what to write in your resume, what sections to add in your resume, everything we will cover and you will be creating a kick ass resume from scratch. So do join this workshop and you will find the link in the description. Now, once you are done with preparing your resume, now let's proceed to the next step arranging a referral. Now referrals are one of the most effective way to get an interview opportunity at these companies, but it's hard to get a referral, especially if you don't have a friend or relative working in these companies, but that's okay. We will figure out some other way. First, we need to craft a message to be sent out asking for referral and that has to be really, really good. And you are in luck today because I have prepared a free referral message template just for you, which you can use while asking for referral. And I have made this completely free for you. So if you want to thank me for this, then do hit the subscribe button and do hit the like button as well. Now coming back, we have a good message to send out now, but whom to send out? That's the next question. Technically, any employee can refer you in any position in the company, but we won't send out random referral requests. First, find our college alumni who are working in that company because college alumni are way more likely to refer their juniors than any other people. If you think you are coming from a bad college and your college alumni won't be working at those big companies, just search and have a look. Next, we will approach the engineering managers working in those companies. These are the people who actually hire for their team. So if you reach out to them, then they will probably have a look at your resume and schedule an interview. So second thing we are going to do is messaging engineering managers. Now after this, if you still don't get any referral, then just randomly approach employees in these companies at your same level or one level upper than you. And once anybody responds to your request, then first thing first, thank them and send them any necessary details that they ask for. So this was about the referral part. Now let's go to the third step that is applying through job website. Recruiters from top companies actually post their job opening in many job websites. So trying out your luck there won't be a bad idea. So these are the few career portals that you can use if you are from India. And if you're in the US, then these are the options you should look for. But here are two things you should do while creating a profile in these websites. Number one. Mention as many details as possible regarding your work experience and projects. Number two, fix a time in the day, maybe let's say 30 minutes in the morning and apply to open roles in these portals at that time. Do this for a few days and you will surely get back some response. Now coming to the last section, approaching the recruiters directly. Now, how do you approach a recruiter? Two options. Number one, LinkedIn and number two, email. Now sending LinkedIn message to the recruiters is very easy. Send them a connection request with a short message and once they accept your request, then follow up. Oh wait, 
what to write in the message so i have attached another free template in the description for this just download it for free and if you want to thank me then do hit the subscribe button now coming back messages are fine but emails are better option i feel but how do you get the recruiter's email id right now once is to go to their profile and click on contact info and find the email id there now many times you may not get the email id because the recruiter may have uh, kept the email id private or maybe linkedin has some subscription based limitation whatever be the reason sometime you will definitely get their email id so it's always good to give it a try so that's it for this video i am very very sure that you must have got a detailed understanding of how to apply to these big companies so if you like my work then do hit the subscribe button and do hit the like button for this video as well and see you in the next video